Hey guys, it's your boy we back with more Mouse UI content and today we are taking a look at Alliance Battle Legend once and for all for Cable. I've never done a 15 million plus video with this guy. Obviously, I was trying to figure him out what is the best rotation, the best gameplay style. So today I'm going to show you guys two runs. The first one is obviously going to be the max build tier 4 Cable. Sadly, I'm really sorry, I could not find a mighty rage cable with tier 4 i really want to do that video uh this is a snare season so she uh, he can cancel with the first skill which is not exactly ideal but still it works out we have the five star artifact with plus 15 so the artifact definitely helps out but the mainly i i would say if even if you have a four star you can still cap with the four star artifact if you have the max build depending on the account so the run i'm gonna show you is gonna be with the 301 brilliant rage also there will be one more run that i will add which will be a tier 3 mighty rage run i really want to do a tier 4 mighty rage but i can do like tier 4 mine but the fact is that he's only used for like one day so i'm really waiting for a better mutant character to come out for that anyways let's just talk about the rotation and how we will play him then i'm i'm gonna show you the build for the tier 3 and then i'm gonna show you both the runs obviously in the end cap as well so the usual 534 remains the same you have to play it that way the only thing that i changed is actually the first skill and rage uh you need usually around four skill to charge up i uh, usually like i would say play him on very low graphics i do play him on very low graphics you can play on low as well but honestly i can't see anything on the screen uh so that's why i just prefer the very low graphics we will be starting off with one five three four usual after that after the fourth blast you can go into second skill this actually gives you a nice burst and sometimes I actually do two cancel one as you will see around the rower times just to get some extra damage in. It actually does slightly more maybe 50k, 100k, I would say 50k around more. So the tier 3 skill is something that you need to worry about. So as I just cancelled right now, uh, you have to cancel that. Otherwise, you won't be able to cancel the tier 3 if Surter moves out of your uh, uh, range okay so usually what i do is i cancel around here to get the blast uh, if i feel that certain is gonna dash away from me then i would do that otherwise i don't do that the fourth skill you can cancel after the four uh whatever the bombs or whatever appear but uh, usually you can also wait for him to shoot for the extra damage and you can just uh, play on that let me just show you the build with my tier 3 cable that this is my own uh, kosh 12345 account so that's how it's gonna be so obviously barely any of those blessings i got a four star artifact and a mighty rage as i said i really want to do a tier 4 mighty rage but sadly i don't have uh, like i do have the materials as you can see but again one day i'm kind of really hesitant and the what if update is coming if something good comes up i'll probably do that so I'm going to start off with the tier 3 cable run on my own account and then we will move on to the maxed out build cable. You need a brilliant to cap. It's not possible otherwise. So as I said before, we will start off with 1534 and then finish with the second skill. I sometimes use this first skill right before the fifth skill comes out of uh, cooldown just to you know do that. Also, I, I forgot to tell you guys uh do not play him without the sfx on okay always play cable with the sfx animations on it helps you okay so we got about 1.8 1.9 million it's pretty good score for uh you know a tier 3 mighty rage cable around the first shore brilliant does about 212 like 2.5 to 2.6 million so it's not far ahead it does get far ahead when you hit the light phase and you will see around uh, the roar time i kind of saved my tier 3 skill look at that i will be cancelling because i have to freaking get the ball i could not get the ball so this is something that kind of decides the cable score for you you know you can score about 500 to 400k lower depending on the runs and you can see i'm instant cancelling because the ball was gonna drop so i did this to collect the ball with the fourth skill this is the best way to start the light phase if you collect the ball on the first or the second movement of your fourth skill, that is considered to be, I would say, the best, you know, uh, way to collect points. And you can see we are doing pretty nice for a mighty rage tier three, almost six million around this time, which is definitely pretty nice. Something, though, is wrong with cable. And I think I can show you that in the 
I think what I think I, I'm not sure if I did that already, but I will show you that what's wrong with cable. I feel it's a glitch. I feel it's kind of like a bug. Uh, what happens is sometimes you, you can see obviously you your fourth skill moves around, right? It's kind of movements based skill. But sometimes look at that cable stands where he is until the last blast. And this is like, I, I don't think this actually hurts you in terms of scores, but it's gonna hurt you really, really badly once you go to the light phase, because you will see, I'm not sure why sometimes around the last light, if you are around this like corners, the force skill doesn't move. And if the force skill doesn't move, the way we collected the first light is not gonna happen. And if that, that does not happen, you basically are losing about 300k to 400k points. That's, that's the amount of difference that actually makes. As you can see, I basically had to run and collect because I did not want to leave the RNG if he's going to move or if he's not going to move. So that kind of decides what will be your cable score. And I kind of messed it up here. I, I'm not sure. Like I should have used the four skill slightly earlier. And we are ending up around, I think, 9.2 or something. Uh, tier 3 cable is hard to play, like hard to score, I would say. Uh, 10 million absolutely is possible if I didn't screw that four skill up in the end that was easy 9.4 or 9.5 uh, about the last uh, phase if that collect was with the four skill absolutely 10 million is in but it's hard with tier 3 cable plus you need Odin's blessings I have like one or two of them on him so you know that's how it is now tier 4 cable uh, again, uh, same thing, just uh, insane amount of damage. Okay, look at that. We are having Ghost Warrior help us out with the buff and all. So it it is pretty nice. You can see we are about 2.5, 2.5 to 2.6 is usually what I get, and this is something that kind of also makes uh, uh, you know you score lower on snare snare season. I would say you cannot activate your Enrage proc every single time, every single rotation. Because the cancel obviously is with the first skill, that's how it is. One more thing to uh, notice is obviously I'm doing the, again, the charge instant cancel, almost instant cancel. Uh, sometimes what uh, happens is when you do the normal rotation, you can cancel some skills early if you really want to. If you feel like certain is going to charge away, if you feel like light phase is on, I always do this uh, and look at that. I'm collecting with the run because it was slightly away from where the fourth skill will move. So I could not collect it. So absolutely this phase could have been better, but it was pretty nice. Not bad, but absolutely if you do collect it with the fourth skill, you are looking at at least 300k to 500k increase, I would say, depending obviously on the run. But 8.7 is pretty good uh, here. As a, like I was saying, if we have gotten with the fourth skill, it was an easy 9 million after the light phase, which was pretty amazing actually. Which kind of rivals Luna. Luna Snow right now actually on a brilliant race something does about I think 9.2 or 9.3 uh, after the first light. So, and this is something also like you can, as, as you saw, I kind of instant cancel or delay, like you know, early cancelled the tier 3 skill right there. The fourth skill actually right there. So, anyways, we will be hitting this thing and we are well over 10 10 million so if you are over 10 million that's uh, usually a sign of you can score 15 million in abx uh, alliance battle legend this was i think my mistake i shouldn't have done this the Surter actually charged towards me so i could have let uh, the tier 3 skill run so we might have gotten maybe 200k 100k extra in that you know uh, so like cables targeting on the tier 3 skill is really bad because it's very slow first of all if certain moves it takes him millenniums to actually catch on to look at this i could have collected but i am i will be going collecting manually because i have had like three runs or two runs where cable did not even move from his place because of this glitch or bug and because of that i'm losing my precious precious points so not exactly the best run no no light was collected with the four skill so but still as you can see it was a comfortable 15 million cap with one rotation to spare as you can see right here and we will be going easily about 300k over 15 million so 15.32 million pretty nice pretty easy uh he's one of the easiest characters to play honestly i don't find him uh worse or hard to play 
So yeah, it does pretty good. And he is absolutely a monster of a freaking beast in Alliance Battle Legend. You could tier for him and for people. I just made uh, wanted to make this guide. By the way, also, I have my spreadsheets ready for ABX and ABL. So the F2P Adventures ABX and ABL guide slash spreadsheet should be coming along with the coming videos very soon on the channel and i hope they will help you guys and also i included rotations for characters and cancels and everything all teams so i hope you do guys like them and they will definitely help you out let me know what you think about the video let me know what you think about cable and as always if you do enjoy the content i hope to see you again take care i'll see you all in the next one see ya